Oscar Bevis, IFL, TV, MTK Global, Umar Khan joins me. Sometimes professional debuts can be a bit mundane. That was a little bit of a tear-up, wasn't it? Yeah, man, you can see from my eyes, all that weren't the easiest of debuts. It was a young opponent himself. It was definitely, uh, he was coming to win. And I've been out for two years as well, so that didn't really help. But yeah, I'm happy to get the win, man. That was good. What sort of stuff do you feel like, or would you notice perhaps that after a two-year layoff are affecting a performance like that? I was just, uh, just a bit like tense, a bit tight. And then on top of that, there's, there was no... Well, I had a few of my family members, but there was fucking... There's like more noise at my amateur fights, man. <laughs> I was going to say, there's no fans. And I said to Hamza, you're almost going to have to like, make your debut again when fans yeah. come in. But they're making a bit of noise. Who are you listening to, by the way? Because Hamza's saying, throw this. I think your uncle and trainers are saying, throw this. Who are you actually listening to? Because you've got about 100 oh, voices yeah, in your ear. All the family and that, I just block them out. I just listen to Will, my coach. And yeah, that was it, man. He was the only really person I was listening to. I could obviously hear what they were saying, but... Obviously, I only listened to the, the main man himself. Well, obviously, the highlight will be the knockdown. Did you think about stepping it on and trying? Because obviously, you can get caught sometimes and you don't want to really slip up early on. But uh, yeah, you can get caught when you go Stephen in. Did you think about going four guns for him? Uh, yeah, I did, but like, I, was just, uh, I was just a bit too tense. That's what it was. I think definitely if I was a lot more relaxed, I'd have got him out there. But yeah, I was happy I got the knockdown. And yeah, no, that was it, man. It was, a, it was a decent performance. How do you actually rate the performance out then? Uh, from knowing what I can do, I'll probably give that like a five, five, six. Yeah. So that means we've got good things to come? Yeah, that's it, man. That's it. Uh, it's all started now. It's a tough introduction. How much do you learn from that, though? Because, like I said, they can be so boring at times. Like, you can just be jumping around, sketching, sort of thing, back foot boxing. How much are you going to learn from the fact that, I don't know, he was frying shoulders, a little bit of head in there as well? Like, he was tough. Yeah, no, 100%. I'll take uh, loads away from that, man. Loads. There's definitely a lot of that I learned from that. So in a way, that, that would, oh, it wasn't my best performance, so I can definitely take a lot, of, a lot from it. I'm back out pretty much straight away, I imagine. Uh, now, so what it is, we've got Ramadan now, so I'll be out for about a month, and then uh, we'll look to get, uh, get going again after that, probably around June, July. And I saw that you had a couple of words with Frank for about 20 seconds. Did he say anything interesting? Yeah, he said he was, he said he was happy with it, so that's good. Uh, so hopefully I can just keep impressing, and I know there's a lot more to come.